everyone, it's Cajun DIY Diva, and today I have another hotel room tour. So, I am in the Cabana Bay Beach Resort at Universal Orlando. It's an on-site hotel, and um, let's show you the room. So, as you walk in, there's this little corner there that could be a place to put a baby crib or... Um, you know, stack some extra luggage. I haven't walked into this room at all yet, so everything is new to me. You have a closet with the iron, iron and board, luggage rack. Looks like extra pillows and linens up there. And here is your vanity area with a uh, kind of retro shaped mirror. Everything is retro, uh, mid-century modern at this hotel. So let's check out the bathroom area. And let's see, where are the lights? Light switches. Um, I just flicked on both switches and the vent did not come on, so I don't know if it's not working or if there's not one in here. Um, so you do have a bathtub, which is great if you have kids. Because a lot of the new hotels are not putting bathtubs at all. You've got some retro V05 hair products and zest soap. That's kind of cool. Um, looks like not so many towels in this room. I would, if I was, this room sleeps four. We'd either have to share towels or I'd have to ask for more towels. So here's the room. It's two queen size beds. And this is just your standard room. It is a poolside room. Has that retro theme again with that bright orange and uh, retro alarm clock. It does have, let's see, there's no USB ports, but there are outlets next to the bed. But let's see if there's any other USB ports. You have a drawer down here with Bible. Um, the TV was on when I came in because I just came in. And you have some storage in this little dresser. And a refrigerator which is going to be empty yes you have a little Cuisinart one cup coffee maker with to-go cups and an assortment of different coffees it's like a Arabi Arabican coffee Cuisinart brand coffee um, two retro chairs and a little retro table with an ice bucket. Um, let's see if there's anything else in the room. I don't see any USB ports on the television. So you will have to bring your own chargers and that sort of thing with your own um, things. Oh, there are, here's a USB port right here. Uh, right next to the table. And so there's two USB ports in this room. So let's take a look at the view. Okay, so there is something in the middle of the window. So, but it's overlooking the pool with the lazy river. This is in the continental section of the hotel. So that is a great looking pool. And the lazy river does look like lots of fun and if you look out you can see uh, you can see a little bit of Volcano Bay over there those tiki huts and things are Volcano Bay and then there's just hotels outside of the resort over there that what you that blue what you can see at the top that is the new Aventura and on this side you can see Universal Studios 
and let's see you can see both you can see that I can see the Hulk I can see the Rip Ride Rocket and Dudley uh, Do-Rights um, yeah so uh, there's another side to this window so let's check this out yeah so just more that you can look at um, there's a little pool down there which I don't know it doesn't look like that's just decorative that's not a pool that you can swim in um, they do have a sandy beach down there looks like lots of uh, chairs beach chairs and lounge chairs by the pool area but I'm sure in the summer when it's a very busy time all those chairs would be taken um, does look like there's little chairs down there uh, that's probably right off the food court so um, you can go get some food in the Bay Liner Diner and probably take it out there to eat or there is there is supposed to be a pool bar out here which I'm not sure where it is but there is supposed to be one so that's my room at Cabana Bay Beach Resort Oh, I did. Uh, pillows are a big deal to me, and there are only two pillows on the bed and a throw pillow. And um, you have this thin coverlet with um, like a it's like a thin duvet. So I do like those kind of blankets. But um, I'm sure you could call and ask for extra pillows if you need them. So. This is Cajun DIY Diva, and thanks for watching.